gender and contemporary TV plays. Uh, contemporary means of the present time, of the present period. Uh, by this we mean uh, the period in development of TV plays in Pakistan uh, during 1990. 90s means the whole decade. In late 1990s, private TV channels were allowed in Pakistan. And this was uh, definitely in reaction to, in response to some factors. Pakistan film industry failed to meet entertainment needs of the viewers, of the cinema goers. So this gap was to be filled by private channels. They started airing dramas which were like films, mini films in form of serials and seasons, uh, definitely copying India. In some dramas, elderly women are doing family politics in giant families and usually these women are mother-in-law or they are elder daughter-in-law, badi bahu jo hai ya badi jo dusri hai families ke log hai, usme especially the mother-in-law, saas. Women in these dramas cause suffering to other women at home. These plays show conflicts between saas and bahus and conflict between Bahus. As the plays were very popular in women, they promoted gender stereotypes of Pakistani society. Women spend most of the time at home and uh, when they are free from their domestic work, the only and the best entertainment resource for them at home is PTV and other channels. And uh, they regularly watch serials and dramas. And as a result of this regular watching of such uh, TV serials, their own thinking about the role of women in giant families, they are influenced. Another impact was showing women with authority and wealth. These dramas, they were uh, set in uh, wealthy families. So the setting was very attractive for those women who aspire for all these things in their life. They should have a large Bangalore, they should have a car, they should have other facilities, jewelry, gold, etc. So living with servants, they are living with servants. There are so many people calling BBG, BBG, Badi Chaudhrani, Choti Chaudhrani, wearing gold jewelry, Whole arms are full with jewelry, with bangles, golden bangles, and living in grand havelis with so many verandas and uh, multi story sometimes, uh, looking like palaces. This was the setting of the, these dramas. It was pushing middle class women. This is the second impact we are talking about. The first was that women suffered at hands of other women at home. The second impact of these dramas was that middle class women who watch these serials regularly 
they also dream of having all these uh, facilities and uh, luxurious uh, lifestyle which they regularly see in these dramas. Here is a task. This is a website, a YouTube. Watch Geo's Lado Mepali. Uh, this was a famous serial and uh, popular also of this period, Lado Mepali. After watching some episodes, as many as you can afford, it depends on the time you have. Try to match what we have said about private channels plays about it. The play was aired, this play, Lado Mepali. It was aired in 2014 and ended in 2015. Long play, serial. It is a romantic story that moves around a boy Vahaj, a stylist, and two girls, Lara, of a wealthy family, and she is in fact the heroine, Lado Mepali, and Bishma. Bishma is her rival. She also loves Vahaj. This play shows the whole family loves the daughter. Anti stereotype. Now, see, we have been talking uh, about uh, difference in parents' attention that is given to sons and daughters. Stereotypically, we say, typically, we say that parents naturally love more to sons. They would shoulder responsibilities. They would support them in their old age, etc., etc. So, here, quite opposite to that, the whole family love the daughter. Not only that, La Reb is the heroine. La Reb is allowed to love a person of her own choice. And this is unthinkable for women of past, especially in culture like Pakistan, that a woman can choose a person even from her own family, from her own cousins. Uh, this was quite unimaginable uh, for her. But this drama goes against the stereotype. And we see this here. So we conclude that it is not fair to conclude, as the researcher we have been talking about, Pakistani gender scholar, who concludes that TV serials always show gender stereotyping. But this example of the play Lado Mepali shows that it is not fair to say that TV serials of the past are present only promote gender stereotypes. They also raise voice against stereotypes. Right? So, this is how the same TV plays can provide people alternative way of thinking about women.